So we just got a new tower in DDS called Necromancer. But did you know that Necromancer is supposed to be a Halloween 20 event tower? And why it get cancelled? Okay, before I start, you better hit that like and subscribe button because it will help me a lot, okay? Okay, let's get started and do the video. So where do I know about this information? That Necromancer is supposed to be a Halloween 20 event tower. So it's all start on community post on YouTube made by Poton. He said that fun fact, Necromancer used to the tower attended for the Halloween event 2020. However, because of the recent Tower Battles drama, it got scrapped and replaced by Toxigano. If you didn't know what drama TDS have with Tower Battles in 2020, is basically just a copy things. But we'll skip that for now. There's another TDS YouTuber called Jordan State. He make a prediction videos about the Halloween 2020 event tower, and he put Necromancer Tower in the titles of his videos. His prediction videos was kind of make sense. If you remember, there's a Necromancer statue in the Halloween 20 maps. Maybe they'll leave the Necromancer Tower as statue here, you know, like Easter egg or something. But yeah, some people might think that this is just a decoration for the maps. If you think that this, the statue are the Reaper enemies, you are wrong, because it doesn't look the same at all. I think what Poton said was true, I guess. At least, we know the reason now, why Toxic Gunner was released so late in 2021, while the event was in 2020, and we have to hear that pain song for 9 months till the first invasion event release. Toxic Gunner and Slager were released at the same time, so most likely this has something to do with TTS and Tor Battle drama in 2020. If some TDS tester want to talk about this with me and say anything about this Necromancer Tower backstory in 2020 and during the development day, I think I'm gonna make a part 2 of this video. Okay, that's all. See you guys again in the next video.